Gear 18 scheme mechanical engineering students welcome back into my another video hope you are all doing well as tomorrow is your examination for the subject uh, applied thermodynamics backlog paper okay 18 me 42 is it a subject code so this is the passing package video and uh, here i will be discussing important questions which you should go through and uh, tackle the subject and pass the subject okay so let me discuss here model wise important questions Derive an expression of uh, air standard efficiency of diesel cycle with neat PV and TS diagrams. Derive an expression of air standard efficiency of an auto cycle and dual cycle with PV and TS diagram. And compare these three auto, diesel and dual cycle based on same compression ratio, heat rejection, same max, uh, maximum pressure and temperature. With a P theta diagram explain the stages of combustion in CI engine. Explain the phenomena of combustion in SI engines. Explain any two methods of deeming frictional power. These are some super important questions from the model first. Now in second module, derive an expression for the optimum pressure ratio for maximum work output in case of a Brayton cycle. Super important question. With the need a sketch explain working of a turbojet ramjet. Uh, with a neat sketch explain gas turbine cycle with the regenerator and derive the cycle efficiency and with a neat sketch explain working of gas turbine cycle with the intercooling and reheating with ts diagram last question from module second with a block diagram and ts diagram explain how regeneration increases thermal efficiency of a gas turbine plant okay if you are convenient go through the numerical part right next is module 3 discuss the effect boiler pressure condenser pressure superheat on the performance of a Rankine cycle sketch and explain the flow diagram and corresponding TS diagram of practical regenerative Rankine cycle with the help of a systematic diagram and HS diagram explain regenerative vapor power cycle with one feed water heater derive an expression for its thermal efficiency Next question, uh, why is Cornard cycle not a, a realistic model for steam power plants? Explain with the appropriate uh, TS diagram. Compare and contrast Carnot and Rankine cycle and also numerical part. It is possible to pass the applied thermodynamics with the theory only, but sometimes papers are unexpected. Papers are more numeric, uh, more problematic. Okay, so you should focus on numericals also. Next is model four. Define the following. This is super important question. That is dry bulb temperature, wet bulb temperature, relative humidity, dew point temperature, degree of saturation. With a neat sketch, describe the working of a bell Coleman cycle with PV and TS diagram. With a neat sketch, explain the working principle of vapor absorption refrigeration system and vapor compression refrigeration system. Write down the desirable properties of refrigerants. Explain the following process by showing them on a uh, bio, showing them on a psychometric chart. Sensible cooling, humidification, cooling and dehumidification, heating and humidifying, adiabatic mixing of two streams of air. Okay, so you have to explain these terminologies over here, right? Now last is here model fifth derive an expression for minimum work input by two stage compressor with intercooler between the two stages derive an expression for critical pressure ratio which gives maximum discharge through the nozzle what are types of nozzles explain with neat sketch these are all theoretical questions which I discussed in this video go through these important questions and if time permits go through the numerical part which are convenient to you people okay so my best wishes are with you I hope you clear the subject uh, this time only and get the certificate with the 18 scheme batch students.